<laughs> so today is Wednesday and I just thought I'd pop in and say hi. Um, I did a you now um, hang out whatever dilly dilly thing of my jig yesterday, whatever you want to call it. So I think it went really well. Um, it was really, you know, fun to just hang out with all of you and talk and those who missed it I apologize um but yeah it was it was a lot of fun we just kind of like I don't know I like to random talk random ask questions it's kind of fun you know to get people's um point of view and stuff so everyone who joined me yesterday I appreciate it it was great talking with you it was great listening to your questions on or your answers on my randomness so I really really appreciate that you know so today um actually marks i think let me see here i want to say it has now been two weeks that i have been on low carb slash keto i would say keto keto i don't know why i'm saying it like that I'm like keto <laughs> so i think it was i'm trying to i'm trying to think when i started this i think it was around the 11th so yeah I was trying to see if I could find when I started, but I don't know. I think it was around the 11th. So, um, how many days is that? I don't know. Let's see here. Um, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, it's been two weeks. It has been two weeks. Um, two weeks and a day. So about 15 days now that I. Oh, God, sorry. It's been about 15 weeks, 15 weeks, 15 days now. So I've been doing it a little bit, about two weeks. I've been doing the keto low carb and I have noticed so many changes, except for my hair, of course. I need to do my hair, please don't. And I freaking forgot to get some bleach again. Oh my gosh, because I gotta bleach these roots. They're just horrid. Anyway, um, two weeks, so I feel um, I still have my pain. So here's the thing. I still have my pain, but I feel so much better. I feel like, I don't know, like me personally, I feel like my face is starting to slim down a little bit. Um, I'm feeling less, well, there's times. So, okay. So here's the thing. Nighttime is really, really tough for me. And so, um, I just find that harder, a harder time for me. So, Nighttime is when I really struggle, so I kind of have to like stay on top of it. But overall, I've been staying within my macros. Um, I'm still not counting calories. That's not what like I'm doing this for. But um, ultimately, like staying low carb and staying within, you know, my my carbs, low carb, high fat. I have been staying within the calorie range. So I haven't really gone. I think I had one higher day and that was, I got up to like 1600 calories, but for the most part, I've been under like 1400 or under. Um, like I said, I'm not really counting the calories, but I just kind of glance to see what they are. Um, so I'm feeling really good. I, you know, I drink coffee once a day, which coffee break. <laughs> I drink coffee once a day, um, sometimes twice. Yesterday I drank it twice, but I, I like to have coffee every day. Um, and then I drink water or tea that I make. Um, what else have I been doing? I mean, I just been staying on top of things and you know, I do a lot of eggs. Um, I actually just got done eating some eggs. I do scrambled. I do over easy. Um, I love soft boiled eggs. I like all of it. You know, I'm doing, um, burgers, no bun. Like at this point in time right now, like I feel like you could not pay me to eat bread. Um, so for me, carbs make me feel like crap. They just do. They make me feel sluggish and tired and it just, it just, it's just awful, you know? So, um, I went back yesterday. So anyway, I'm kind of like jumping all over the place. So anyway, I've been doing this for two weeks. I feel better. Um, my fibromyalgia symptoms seem to be 
not gone, but lessened. Like I'm not in so much pain from my fibromyalgia. Um, sorry, I'm so tired today, but um, obviously it's still there. I still have the back pain, not as bad, but I still have the back pain. Um, what else? Like my PCOS seems to be a lot better. I do get a lot of, um, I have dark spots. I have facial, a little bit of facial hair sometimes, you know, but that's just how life is. And there's nothing I can do about it, but just try to do better. So my diet just seems to be better. Um, when I go to the store, like I'm not like seeking out sweets like I once was. Um, you know, and here's the thing, just because other people in my house eat a certain way, doesn't mean I need to do it. So I've made that choice. And then um, to, last night I decided to post in one of the um, WLS groups on Facebook. Big mistake, big mistake. You know, they like to tear you apart and tell you what you're doing wrong and what you, and you know, the thing I find funny is that the people who are saying this are people who just had surgery. Like they just had surgery, you know, and stuff. So I'm almost four years out. I really accept anyone's suggestions. But, you know, it's like, I don't, I don't know. Like, I've been struggling with this weight, and I, I do, yes, I have a little regain. Because, yes, maybe I wasn't making the smartest choices. But, you know, we all, that all, that happens with everyone. You know, that happens with everybody. So, you know, it is what it is. And, you know, I'm just getting back out there you know, exercising, eat, trying to eat the best that I can. Um, so am I doing better than I was last month? Oh, hell yes. Hell yes. Excuse me, but hell yes. Um, I, last month I was eating crap and I was like, I don't know why I'm not. Yes, I did, you know, and I'm still staying strong with the nine pounds lost, which nine pounds I lost last week or the first week. And now the second week, I'm just kind of hanging on to that nine pounds, which is fine. I'm totally okay with it, you know? I didn't expect to lose like 50 pounds in two weeks. Like, that wasn't, you know, that wasn't the thing. But I feel great. Um, my energy is definitely up more. I don't feel so sluggish. Um, I sleep better. I just, I feel so much better, you know? So, yeah. So Friday, I'm going to be having a party it's um my friend's gonna come over it's a pure romance party and she's asked me to host one well she asked me if I wanted to and I was like I guess so so yeah I'm hoping a few ladies show up and then um she's gonna try to go live in the group that she started for me for the event and so um she's gonna try to go live for the people who don't live near me so that's gonna be kind of cool and this will be the first time that she's doing that. So that's going to be really awesome. I have a few people who are from out of town who are going to be watching. So I'm excited to to do that. That'll be fun. Um, but other than that, I'm just I'm just here. I'm just hanging out and um, enjoying, enjoying life the best that I can, you know. So anyway, I just wanted to come on here. I don't know when I'm going to jump on you now again. It could be tonight, it could be tomorrow, it could be Friday, or it could be next week. I don't know. Um, usually on Mondays, I will be doing, um, going live on You Now with Nirvana. I think we're going to do Mondays, because that's, Mondays and Wednesdays are usually when she's more available. But I think we're going to be doing Mondays, so, you know, I think that's what she said. But anyway, yeah, you definitely um, can watch you know us together on you now or on her youtube on monday nights um and yeah that's pretty much it so let me know if you like my intro that i made i um was was there for a long time trying to put it together um i think it turned out okay and yeah so just want to get your opinion but things are good i feel great and i I'm enjoying what I'm doing you know it's every day is a new day and I don't overthink things so like I don't know what I'm gonna eat tomorrow you know I don't I have to just take today at one day at a time like today 
you know, and then tomorrow I'll, I'll deal with that. But I always have staples. I always have um, eggs. I always have cream cheese. I always have butter, sour cream, um, always like sausages or hamburger or and bacon. Like those are staples in my house because that's what, you know, that's what helps me get through this. So I'm feeling wonderful and, you know, my way and the things that I'm doing may not be what other people think or other people choose to do, but this is what I choose to do and I'm feeling good about it and about doing this. So just because this isn't your path, you know, I won't judge your path and you don't judge mine. How about that? <laughs> so anyway, guys, um, thanks for listening and just always being here for me and I will talk to you later. Bye.